Don Crisman, who's a member of the Haven't Missed the Super Bowl Club. So he was one of four original friends, a gentleman that went to the first couple of Super Bowls. The first one, I think, in 1967, which is in the little small box over there. And they continued to go. And I think after the third or fourth one, um, they actually decided that they wanted to make this an annual trip. And um, so they have been, they literally are right now at the 47th Super Bowl down in New Orleans and they've been to every single one. And he has collected memorabilia from each and every single one of his trips. Cereal boxes, different pins from various and sundry, um, different Super Bowls throughout 47 years. And he's sharing them with us until the end of March so that they will be here but I would say that this is probably just about a tenth and maybe even of what he has. This is a chair that is part of the exhibit that's actually not from Mr. Crisman's collection and this was a gift from the Patriots um, back to Huzzy Seating and it's signed from the Super Bowl, their first Super Bowl win in, on February 3rd, 2002. His most prized part of his collection, he tells us, is his tickets because they really were the genesis of, of all the wonderful things that he's had uh, and uh, the times that he's had at the different Super Bowls. This is a great poster from when the two leagues, the American Football League and the National Football League, actually joined together to form the NFL. Um, so he, that, I think, is a really great um, poster that shows the teams back in uh, 1967 not only are we as a museum um, going through the whole history of the town of Kennebunk, but we're very, very pleased that this is kind of living history and that it's continuing. It, it goes back 47 years, but it's continuing today. Kennebunk TV, telling the story of a great community that is making a difference.